in Empire League Soccer, top-ranked Pacifica takes on Valencia, and as Natasha Paul reports, the Tigers are looking for revenge after a loss to the Mariners last month. The Tigers lost 2-1 to one in their last outing against Pacifica, and this is their last chance to even the score. But it's not an easy goal. The Mariners are at the top of the Empire with only one league loss. Valencia gets control of the ball to gain an early lead, but doesn't quite get the momentum going. Both teams off to a slow start with a scoreless first half. During the break, the Pacifica girls stretch and listen to coach Matt Etchison's words of wisdom. And those words pay off. Shortly into the second, senior Sasha Diaz kicks one high for the goal. The Tigers keep their heads in the game and so do the Mariners as Taylor Nelson tries to knock one in for the score. Goalie Alicia Donnell is forced to the ground to give Nelson the easy goal for a 2-0 lead. Valencia tries again to put something on the board, but the goalie makes the save. Pacifica comes back for more as Nelson slides for a clear kick into the goal. A smiling Nelson runs down the field and within seconds the game is called and Pacifica wins 3-0. The Mariners are used to success. This is their third outstanding season since joining the Empire League in 2006. They finished the season as number one, and going into the playoffs, coach says anything can happen. Our chances of going deep in the playoffs and winning the CIF championship will depend on being healthy and, you know, playing well and having a little blood of luck sprinkled in there. It's always important. It, you know, you have to have that good fortune that, you know, that day shines upon you. In Empire League boys hoops, Valencia and Cyprus are tied at the top with Pacifica in third. The Mariners have a 5-4 record and lost to the Tigers by one point at home. Reporter Katie Wilfong has the highlights from the rematch, which surprised everyone except Pacifica. <laughs> It's a big night for Pacifica as the Mariners fight for a playoff spot, but that doesn't put a damper on the Tigers' spirit. Second half, the Mariners lead 31 to 13, but the battle doesn't stop till the very end. Pacifica's Jason Dietrich brings it to the center and hands it off to Nick Myers to make the score. Moments later, Pacifica's Albert Hughes tosses it to Myers, who brings it down the court, hands it to Jason Connor, then gives it back to Myers. He passes Dietrich for a hard-earned three. Now that's what I call teamwork. 38 to 17 Pacifica. A very stunned Valencia fights back. Omar Perez passes the ball to James Holden for an easy jumper. It's 44-19 now. Later in the third, Holden passes to Greg Hammond. He puts it through the net for two. Pacifica's up by 23. Fourth period now, Holden passes to Perez and he makes it from downtown. The crowd gets wild. Dietrich does a side pass to Connor and he puts it in for three more. 51 to 31 Mariners. Later in the fourth, Valencia plays defense. Dominic Grace intercepts the ball on the pass attempt from Connor and brings it down the court for a nice jumper, 57-35. When the buzzer goes off, the Mariners celebrate their big win, 61-43. They had to win to win the league. We had no pressure on us. Go out and have fun, you know, and that's what we did. I thought uh, the kids just did a good job of just staying really relaxed tonight and just doing what we do best. We're playing probably our best basketball season right now, given the competition. This is Katie Wolfong reporting.